and uh, the fence is energized at 7,000 volts. So here's what happens. It's uh, 7,000 volts of electricity right there. Hi. Welcome to the St. Patrick's Day edition of TTV. It is the day after St. Patrick's Day, but we're still celebrating. Oh, yeah. Why not? Oh, yeah. And... Uh, it is March 18th, 2021. I'm Tim! And I'm Billy. And in today's news... Uh, Patrick Cooper possibly beat the Guinness World Record on March 8th by swinging for 36 hours. Wow. Back and forth. Backwards and forwards on the park's swing in Terradale, in Terradale Napier, New Zealand. It's a lot of swinging. He raised money for Starship Hospital. So far, he raised $2,300 and counting. Wow. And that article is from i.stuff.co.nz. And in local news... Huge news. Dave and Busters and Wonderworks to finally reopen soon at Destiny USA on March 26th. At Dave and Busters, masks signed for everyone and gloves if requested. Which I don't know about you guys, but I'll probably request gloves. <laughs> there will be a staff assigned to sanitize tables and games regularly. And Wonderworks, face masks for three years and older, and distancing and equipment are is cleaned in between each use. And on this week in history, on March 19th, 1974, 47 years ago, Jefferson Starship begins first tour. On March 20th, 1930, 91 years ago, Colonel Sanders and KFC is founded. Oh, wow. And in, in North Corbin, Kentucky. On March 20th, 1999, 22 years ago, Legoland, California opened. And, and they, and they, the Disney Park in California is going to open a California residence at the end of next month, I heard. Oh, wow. And end of April. <laughs> on March 21st, 2000, 21 years ago, NSYNC releases No Strings Attached. On March 22nd, 1822, mm -hmm. 199 years ago, New York Horticultural Society founded. Uh, and that's important because... Hopefully, crossing off everything we have right now, mm. what's going down at the 2021 New York State Fair happens this summer. <laughs> I hope. Yeah, we hope. It was a boring day in history on March 23rd. Big time. On March 24th, 1939, 82 years ago, Wuthering Heights movie premieres. On March 25th, 31, uh, 1,990 years ago, the first Easter happened. Oh! On March 25th, 1863, 158 years ago, first United States Army Medal of Honor awarded. And in non-famous birthdays, Jennifer Savastino on March 18th, Zach Kreitzer and Shannon McHugh on March 19th, David Quinn on March 21st. And in air show news... Did you know an airshow team travels over 300 days a year? Yikes. 
Their families only get to see them for what? 65 days out of the year? That's it. <laughs> That's two, it. Two months. And in events news, Friday, March 19th, imagine John Lennon movie, Center for the Arts of Homer, at 7 o'clock p.m. Saturday, March 20th, Easter drive through celebration, the Fireside Inn in Baldwinsville, at high noon. Sunday, March 21st, Climbing Club, Central Rock Gym Syracuse at 9 o'clock a.m. Monday, March 22nd, Dunham Public Library Walking Club at 9 o'clock a.m. Which really sucks, kids. Because <laughs> I have a daily orange on Mondays. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd be doing it. On Tuesday, March 23rd, Live Teen Tuesday from home at 4 o'clock p.m. And that's the Fayetteville Free Library. Wednesday, March 24th, rain at the Stanley Utica at 7.30 p.m. Thursday, March 25th, intermediate line dancing at the Kirkland Art Center of Clinton at 7 o'clock p.m. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta start getting our groove on again a little more. Yeah, big time. <laughs> Around here. I, I, I mean, I've done that. I've done that. I did the spectacular last. You did the so uh, dance this year, right? Earlier this year, or was that last year? The virtual yeah, dance. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. The spectacular. Oh, wow, was that long ago? Yeah. Wow. It was okay. in June of last year. Holy crow! And now it's time for Tim's joke of the day. Why do bees hum? Why? <laughs> they don't remember the lyrics. Oh, that's a good one. That's good. Uh, in, in entertainment news: local movie theaters are now opening on April fifth. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully. Just in case. Just, just in, in time. Just in time for the theatrical release of the longer-rated reboot of uh, of what we talked about on Tim's movie poster reviews yesterday. Oh yeah. Mortal Kombat. It's gonna be a big one. Also, it's been announced that The Gray Man, an upcoming thriller starring Ryan Gosling and Chris Evans, will be filming in Prague, Czech Republic, starting this summer, for a release date sometime in 2022. Oh, wow. And in weather... <laughs> Look forward to a cold but dry weekend in central New York. Temperatures will top out at 35 degrees on Friday, the 19th, with it getting down to 20 degrees Friday night. Saturday will be 51 degrees during the day with a few clouds, and 27 degrees that evening. Mm -hmm. Sunday will be sunny and warm with a high of 57 degrees and a low of 31. Monday will be the best day of the week with a high way up to 61 degrees and a low of 36 degrees. Tuesday won't be bad with clouds and a high of 63 degrees and a low of 38 degrees. Not too bad. Enjoy the good days. Yeah. <laughs> Enjoy the sunny days because yep. we don't get them all, a lot around here. Oh, yeah. I even asked my mom because the boots are starting to, the boots are starting to get in the way. It's oh, like, yeah. It's like, can we put these away yet? Pretty soon. And in famous birthdays. Let's say happy birthday to comedian Dane Cook. Welcome to your 40s, Adams Levine. Queen Latifah is a birthday girl. Dirty Jobs host Mike Rowe, Wilson Pickett, and Lily Collins have happy birthdays as well. Last but not least, singer Vanessa Williams celebrates her day of birth too. Nice. And you can email us at timstv1 at yahoo.com. Like us on Facebook, Tim's Television TTV. Follow us on Twitter at Tim's TV One, and like Tim Better Productions on Facebook. And make sure you subscribe to Tim's Television TTV on YouTube. Mm -hmm. and, and and make sure you comment to on our St. Patrick's Day attire. Chicken wings. <laughs> and yeah, chicken wings. Chicken wings in the comments below. So oh. until next time, I'm Tim. And I'm Billy. Uh, hey, I wrote all that. No, I'm kidding. Ah, <laughs> the Irish slut. <laughs> and uh, the fence is energized at 7,000 volts.
So here's what happens. It's uh, 7,000 volts of electricity right there.